Hello everybody and welcome back to some more sim airport things may be looking a little bit different and I have some terrible 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 news I lost a recording I recorded for like an hour and a half did a whole bunch of awesome stuff to the airport went a long way made a butt ton of money and I completely lost that recording the audio got corrupted it was very very sad so we'll try and uh, catch up what we got going on here so we have our double runways, they are functional at night time, I have runway PAPI and the runway LS, so I've fully upgraded both of our runways, so airlines should be liking us a bit more, it's gone up a little bit, not a crazy amount. Uh, the fourth gate is now 100% functional, and the terminal is looking sweet, check this out, we got some cool patterns going on through here, it's nice and symmetrical, wait what the heck, what happened there, <laughs> how dare you. All right, let's fix that real quick. There we go. Spend a good $200 on flooring right there. We've got some nice carpet. The queues are looking fantastic. We actually have two queues on both sides now. I don't remember if that was last episode or the previous one we did this, but uh, all of these shorter ones are first class. Let's see if we can see. Yep. So first class, coach, coach, first class, first class, coach, coach, first class. So there we go. It's been, it's really helped speeding things along, getting people boarded on their planes fast enough. I think it's working out fantastic, and I'm really excited to show you guys. Remember guys, if you're enjoying Sim Airport, make sure you let me know by making that gray thumb turn blue. Leaving a like, that's the best way to let me know that you guys want to see more Sim Airport in the future. Yeah, that is really annoying, that scrolling. I'm going to keep doing it, just to annoy people. But there we go, I think that's about it. Oh, we did uh, move this tunnel over here so it's nice and centered, and then uh, closed off the baggage area. And we have some room up here if we eventually want to add some more baggage claim, but I haven't seen more than just two of them being used at one time, so I think we're okay there. Everything is going to be okay. Uh, Security is looking fantastic with all these body scanners we got here. People are just flying through like crazy. And some people were telling me that I really shouldn't have benches here, because this might be causing people to miss their flights. So we're going to go ahead and remove those. I, I guess it makes sense. The, the people probably just sit down on benches just for funsies. Well, I guess not for funsies, but you know what I mean. Uh, they sit down on benches uh, when they're waiting for flights. So if they sit over here, they're too far away from the flights to get there in time. So that could be the issue. But I am absolutely loving how this airport looks. Check out all this. And we have some exciting news today. I have this space open here, and I have it there for a reason. I checked on the Sim Airport Twitter, and they had an experimental build ready with cafes re-enabled. So we're going to try and build ourselves a cafe today. I think that'll be nice. Uh, we can just try and squeeze it right in here. Uh, block by putting instruction. Uh, yeah, yeah. Oh my god, it's so annoying how it does that. But I think we'll just go ahead and do something like this. Just try and squeeze in a cafe right there. That's a, that's a decent size. It's not horrible. And let's actually... Oh my god, it's going to do that, isn't it? Oh, there's planning too. That's handy. Okay, I like that. That's really cool. Alright, let's go over here. Or there. There we go. And leave a nice opening. So, they'll get to work on that. They'll do the little cafe in there. Let's do a different floor in the cafe. Uh, t -t 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 don't really like any of these. I mean, this carpet's kind of gross. Uh, we can do this floor. How about that? There we go. They're getting to work. And we'll see how this looks. Uh, getting a little bit of lag. Now, how many passengers we got? Uh, only 500, 600. Ooh, it's shooting up. Here comes the people, man. Woo! Yeah, we might hit 1,000 pretty soon if we keep adding more flights. Oh, and speaking of flights, I did... Uh, add a bunch more, and I staggered them out. So now we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 40, 15, 16. We have 17 flights. I squeezed in one little Aerostar there at 10 p.m. Just because there was a nice gap. But there we go. Have them all nice and staggered out pretty much as early and as late as I can. Well, with leaving a gap in between and also staggering them so our runways uh, are useful. Because we only got two runways. We have four flights coming in within a couple hours of each other. So I want to make sure they can all fit. Let's see. Uh, this is going to disrupt some people a little bit, but it shouldn't be too bad having these walls here. Oh, now people are getting stuck. <laughs> Freaking idiots, man. Oh, my God. They're all going to miss their flights because they're all so stupid. Hey, you get out of there. There we go. Yeah, they're getting really confused. It would have been better to build this stuff at night when there's fewer people walking around. There we go. All right, the cafe is nice and sectioned off. Uh, let's go ahead and sell the supplies. And so we're going to have the cafe in here and then have our little kitchen back here in its own enclosed space. Uh, let's also build... Uh, let's do this carpet. I think that'll look nice there. We probably don't need a door there. We'll probably just leave it open. I don't know if it has to be an enclosed space. We'll try it later and we'll see if that works. Uh, let's see if we can fit the kitchen in here. 
Get you, get you, get you in. There we go. Let's see. We probably don't need that much space. I mean, that's probably plenty. So we need kitchen sink, cooker, prep cart. Let's grab those for first. Okay, kitchen sink. Put it right over there. Then we need a prep cart. We can probably put it there. And then we need a cooker. All right there. We can probably put it right next to the kitchen sink. All right, what else do we need? Uh, refrigerator, pizza oven, and closed space. So we need a refrigerator. And a pizza oven. Pizza, pizza. There we go. Yeah, we'll have plenty of room in here. And then we're just going to make it an enclosed space. So we can probably just put that right there. Alright. And then we need a door. Alright. Oh, under objects. There we go. And then it'll be an enclosed space. Alright. So we got to build in there, guys. And while they're doing that, let's go ahead and zone this as a cafe. Very nice looking little cafe. Beautiful. Alright, we need cash register, cafe, tables, and cafe, chairs. That's right. Alright. Kitchen's looking good. We can go ahead and sell that. And let's start setting up our tables. There you go. Just something like that should be good. And squeeze a bunch in there. Uh, I just wanted to make a relatively nice looking pattern. I think that's good. It keeps this area in the middle nice and clear. And now we just need a cash register. We can probably set that up. Uh, right here or something. Yeah, that's probably fine. Alright, hurry up and build that, guys, and then I'll get the restaurant workers in, or the food workers, rather. Well, let's go and assign this to the kitchen, and it says it is functional. So let's go get food worker there, food worker there. <laughs> don't know how many we need. Probably don't need that many, so three is probably fine. We got four, and they're all standing on top of each other. Alright, oh, wait, no, we have three now. I think that one was just leaving. So let's see if this works. Hey! Oh my god, dude, they're doing it, they're doing it! Haha! -ha! Making pizza! Fantastic! Little dude's taking a seat right there. Haha! <laughs> yes! Bringing out the pizza. You enjoy that pizza. That's on top of your head for some reason. Oh man! Just ate an, ate an entire pizza like that! That's nuts. So the, yes, the cafe is functioning. Oh, that makes me so very happy, guys. Haha! <laughs> oh man, that's awesome. Let's do a little decorating in here. First, let's get some garbage bins. Just so people, you know, can put their, throw their garbage away. Just so they stop leaving it literally all over the place. It's so gross. Right, that one was an accident. Cancel that. And then maybe do some decorative bushes in here. Everybody likes a nice decorative bush. Put those in there. Do we have any, like, potted plants? We got palm trees. Oh, we can't put trees inside, unfortunately. Lame! Oh dang, we might need to do a queue for the cash register. Actually, let's just do a second cash register. Right there. Uh, I think that's facing the wrong way, actually. Cancel that. Uh, cash register. There we go. And let's go ahead and add another food worker. Right there. And now we'll do some queues for them. So we'll just do a nice queue there, a nice queue there. And we'll sign this one. Sign to this queue. Yeah, let's make it first class passengers only. <laughs> Yeah, right. All right, now people are queuing up. Fantastic. So it's a little bit of a tight space, but it's okay. And then once they build this one, I'll go ahead and assign it to this queue. And we can expand the queue pretty much as far as we can, or if need be. Look at that. So many people. Wait, is this dude stealing the tray? He's stealing a tray. Oh, no. He chucked it in the garbage. All right. Assigned to the kitchen and assigned to the queue. Must be able to serve food. It, it, it can. Here we go. Oh, man. I'm so, I'm so happy. I love it. This little cafe. Cafe seat up. I love it. Oh, well, now that I added the cafe, don't really know what else to do. Might as well wrap the airport around here and try and add some. Um, could do larger gates. We could add a fifth gate here and then wrap it this way. Let's see, how big are the large gates? Okay, I think we can do that. Let's go ahead and add our fifth gate here. Let's not. Have it on the wrong side this time. <laughs> Dummy seat top. Actually, cancel that. Yeah, I know we just wasted money, but whatever. Um, because I like having the symmetrical. If we did just one more gate, then we'd only have one half of our cemetery. So what if we did two more and then wrapped it around here and then had the uh, large aircraft gates over there? I think that'll be good. So we're gonna do two more there. So we're gonna do quite the expansion today. Huge expansion. There we go. Oh, oh, we're back down to no monies. Oh my god, it hurts. It hurts a lot. 
In addition to that, we're going to need some new taxiways. It's <laughs> $64,000, man. Oh, we had so much money. What did that airplane do? And like, whoop, whoop. Kind of went flying around for a bit. Oh, my God. So much money. I was like, oh, man, I got a lot of cash. Look at me. $300,000. Aren't I the cool guy? But nope. Now we're back down to nothing. Jesus. All right. Okay, yeah. So the biggest loan we can take is another 100000 So basically what I do in this game is just let it run for like a couple hours. <laughs> and just build up money. That's the only way I can actually get things done in this game. I feel like I say that a lot. I should stop bringing it up. But we're bringing a little bit of more cash now with the, uh, the cafe. Let's see. Retail food income. Oh, 500 bucks. That could buy... Two squares of floor. <laughs> oh my god, that's nothing. That is pathetic. Look at that, 560 bucks. I'm, I'm barely even... I'm barely exaggerating. That's the messed up thing. I think each floor is like 200 bucks. Well, that's something I also did last episode. I added a medium hangar with a couple more fuel trucks. So we have two fuel trucks and two baggage trucks. Uh, the fuel trucks, you'll see them come out here. And guess what? <laughs> they refuel the airplanes. Oh my god. Who, who would have thought? Who would have suspected such a thing? These are the baggage guys. Don't know where the fuel guys are. I've seen them come out before. They're just shy. See? Yeah, fuel trucks in there. Maybe maybe we don't actually use them that. I'm pretty sure that plane just drove over the baggage car, but whatever. Alright, we need to get this going. Get this all set up. Let's see. I guess we'll just do the default floor, even though we'll eventually change it. Oh, it's so very expensive. So very. Actually, let's not. We'll do that later. Let's go ahead and start setting up the basic things here that we need. So we need a large sliding door there, large sliding door there. Uh, this might need to be expanded a little bit. Um, yeah, well, I need to expand this by one more. Dang it. All right, just one more. All right, and while they're doing that, we can go ahead and get the gay agent things set up there. Oh, clicked in the wrong spot. Messing up already. And then we're just going to do the exact same symmetrical look over here. Is that right? That should be this one. So it should be going that way. There we go. Now those cues are looking nice. We can go and assign them to first class. Assign. Assign. And this one we can do. Assign. This one's going to be coach only. Assign. Assign. This should be good there. Uh, gate. It has an aircraft gate. It's you stupid game. Okay. Well, let's get some more staff over here. One, two. Oh, the game's paused. Maybe that's why. And then we'll do three, four. Over here. There we go. Okay, just gotta do the same here. And then almost have enough for the taxiway. Come on. Somebody land. Or somebody take off. Oh, we gotta pay our staff wages. Dang it. Somebody. Oh, wait. Well, I think it's the end of the day, so no one's actually gonna land. Okay, we'll do that next. Well, while we're waiting on that, actually, we can just go ahead and get the benches. And yes, I know this is going to take more money, but whatever. It's okay. How did I have these set up? We didn't have benches by first class, right? Nope. We just had them down here. That's right. This is how I had these set up. No, no, stop, 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 stop. Messed it up. Messed it up. I'm always misclicking. It's because I'm zoomed out too far. got to zoom in. There we go. Put that in the center. And then those go down, staggered by one. It's facing the wrong freaking way. <laughs> Oh my god, guys. I don't know what's wrong with me. It's early in the morning, okay? It's not my fault. And I think that's about everything. We got the bins and the flight info display. So now we gotta get the carpet set up here. Just goes like that. And then over there. And that's how it should look, right? Just right past the trash cans. There we go. Alright, and now we're cooking. And then I forgot I did fill in these gaps a little bit. Like so, and that should be good. Everything else can just be the other floor, right? Haha. -ha. Oh, wait, we gotta do the queues. That's right. The queues were this carpet. And I think that's about everything, so I'm just gonna let them fill this in. And then we need to get back up to $64,000 just so we can get the taxiways in front of these brand new double airplane gates. We're gonna have so many flights coming in, man. Probably gonna need to expand our security quite a bit. There we go. Now we have enough money to do it. $64,000. There we go. Hurry up and do it, buddy. I want to get some more flights, guys, because we're really not making much. We're spending $20,000 in staff expenses now, so we're only bringing in $47,000 a day. So, yeah, really need some more money coming in, and we can do that with a lot more flights coming in here. Because we have the two uh, landing pads, landing 
runways. <laughs> what are the words? It's not a helicopter or a spaceship. It's not a landing pad. I also do want to connect this over here. Uh, that'll probably cost quite a bit of cash. Yeah, to, to extend this out here, that's probably going to be like another $200,000. So uh, we'll just have him run over here and use this gate for now. But there we go. Gate is functional. Now we can get some more planes coming in. Check this out. Look at all that. So let's get one, two, three, four. So at least four more flights. We should be good. So we need a morning. Morning. Let's pause it real quick while I get these figured out. We need an afternoon. We probably need two mornings. Let's grab another morning flight here. God, I wish they would just not show me the large gate ones. Morning, afternoon. And then let's see. You can get an afternoon. And let's see. Let's, let's shuffle those around see what we got. All right. Star flights. You go down here. Aero time, you go there. Oh, we can we can probably do way more. But we don't want too many new passengers just because, you know, that's going to overrun our ticketing and our security. So we can let's, let's have a couple more flights. So there we go. Now we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23. 23 flights. Ugh. Might be too many. Oh, I guess we'll see. Uh, well, while we're doing that, let's go ahead and add maybe another uh, security or some more security down here. So we need ID check stand. Oh, and then maybe a uh, bag scanner. And then we didn't like pricing, so we can bump it up just just a tiny bit. There we go. Hopefully, uh, they won't destroy the interest. But I mean, they're already under contract, so what what are they gonna do about it? Hey, and just like that, our new gates are being used. Hooray! Look at them go. All that money, 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 money. Ooh, look at that. Flyhouse income is now $151,000. Okay, getting a lot more now. Hopefully we can handle it. Let's see. Currently only that's 700 people. Oh, man. So many flights coming in. Got to make sure none of them are getting scheduled or canceled or anything because you can't reserve runways or gates. They should be okay. I mean, yeah, we still have like two hours in between every fly at every gate. So it should be all right. Hell, I could even throw in another cafe here if I really wanted to. That would be something. But the plan is to basically um, wrap it around here. Like either do like an L. So we just have it over here. And then maybe we could do like a second, uh, third runway over here. And then along this side, do the larger uh, airplane gates. Because right there, see, we can squeeze, we can squeeze barely a terminal, or a uh, terminal, a runway behind it. Taxi. Taxi is what I meant. We can squeeze a taxiway behind it. So that'll be good. Oh, it's blocking by the wall. Oh, that's stupid. Oh, that's annoying. All right, might have to shrink that queue a little bit, but then it won't be symmetrical. Oh, no. Can't have that. That would just be anarchy. And let's go ahead and set up the new kitchen cafe thing. I think it'll be good. Oh, wait. We're missing a piece right there. There we go. Oh, wait. No, not walls. Stop it. Don't do walls. It's supposed to be carpet. Must be symmetrical. I do like that people are actually using the carpet now. Now that they can't just flow across the air in these big openings. It does look pretty cool. <laughs> hey, people are using it. I'm so happy. Oh, it's coming together, man. I'm loving this airport. It's looking great. Uh, we're not getting bottlenecked that security or ticketing yet, so that's really, 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 really good. Uh, these people seem to have completely stopped. And this guy is freaking out. Look at him. He is not happy. Okay. Uh, d d I don't know what's going on there. You're all going to miss your flight. Just just a heads up. But all right. <laughs> just go do your thing, man. Oh, man. We're <laughs> we got 1,380 people here. Okay, yeah, we're really gonna need to change our drop off and pick up zones Drop off and pick up zones because it is it is nuts, man. Okay <laughs> it's Way too many freaking people Oh, our ticketing and security is doing all right though. Oh And it's so late at night <laughs> These poor people so Are some of them just leaving? <laughs> they're just going they're just going on foot. They're just walking down the road. Look at this. <laughs> Okay, we might have a few too many flights for now. <laughs> oh man, look at the cars are all being backed up like crazy. Alright, we're definitely going to have to work on that probably in the next episode, but 
Did we get this working? Why is this not working? Kitchen must be able to serve food. It, it can. It is serving food. <laughs> oh, the game is not liking this, man. Yeah, we got way too many flights. But, apart from that, the airport is looking pretty damn good. I'm super pissed that we lost the previous recording, but this recording went alright. If you guys not so, or you're enjoying, or you're just in a great mood, make sure you let me know by leaving a like, leaving a comment, leave something, let me know. I will see you next time. Bye.